Ready? Up and take. The Olympics! Today we're doing the Olympics, Greek style, and not like current Greek, but old Greek. The Olympics are an amazing global competition of basically everything I'm terrible at. I love the Olympics because it's just like war, but no one actually dies. We're here at the Getty Villa, which is one of the largest collections of Greek and Roman antiquities. To learn from an education specialist in archaeology all about the ancient Olympics. The Olympics are called the Olympics because they're at Olympia, so that's the place they started in 776 BC. And they lasted over a thousand years. I'm not good at sports, but I do like mythology. I can appreciate the studious side of the Olympics. The Games is probably symbolic of getting fit for war activities, and it's also just because because you're honoring gods. I just assumed that they were kind of like our games today, just with way more white people. As long as you were a Greek, you could come from anywhere in the Mediterranean and come to the games. You were representing your city-state, and your city-state, just as we are, was very excited about your competition. Today, I am representing the great state of Nemea which is where Zeus is from, king of the gods. I'm representing the great city of Athens because it's the most New York. And uh, we assume that Athens were like the, the Jews of Greece. I will be representing the city-state of Corinth, which of course is related to Poseidon, and we all know I have a great history with the ocean. Oh, oh, he's throwing up. I'll be representing the city-state of Delphi because they just have lots of temples and they do weird shit in them. I love oral. How are they different from the modern Olympics? No women um, are allowed in the Olympics. Boo. Oh, that's yeah. a bummer. And there's no really good fabric, so naked is good. Um, Wait, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who do you think is going to win? Well, you uh, have to take your clothes off first. <laughs> <laughs> oil up before the events to protect themselves from sun. Officiate, we need our oil. Yeah, all right. Thank you. Sorry, Katie. Yeah. What do I, right. do I splash it? All Just right. rub it on yourselves. <laughs> oh, it's so much thicker oh, than you think. Oh, wow. Nice. It's luxurious. I, <laughs> I don't care for it. So everyone's naked, they're oily, they're dirty, and there's no women allowed. Right. Sounds like our kind of party. Let's get that fanny. No, Keith! You gotta get that fanny! Pie, no. You actually have artifacts here at the Getty Villa that depict some of these events. Yes, so this would be a men's category victor, and there are no weight classes, so you could go up against anybody. He's not circumcised. It's a sign of being a barbarian that you circumcise your penis, and sometimes athletes tie Whoa. up their penises. <laughs> She said that you had to tie your string to your foreskin. I'm out. I'm out too. I'm no comment. Well, Looks like out. that's a job for Keith then. <laughs> Bring on the dick string. Sorry, Rachel. Thank, Thank you, you, Rachel. Ra Thank you, Rachel. It's a lovely dress. Yeah, you look great. She said tie it like a water balloon. There's not a lot to, it's pretty shrunken because of the pressure, I'll, I'll be honest. It's like you put a leash on a snake. Yeah, well, your snakes are gonna get away. Mine's gonna stay put. If you have worked to be worthy of going to Olympia. I love winning. I've modeled my life after Hercules. Hercules killed his wife and kids. What? If you've done nothing indolent or base. I'm not above cheating. So, uh, I, yeah, I'm just gonna probably cheat my way through this. If you have trained properly for 10 straight months, you may go forth with a good and positive attitude to Olympia. About 10 straight minutes. Everyone who competes in the Olympics, whether it be in ancient times or this year in Brazil, we're gonna see the same thing happen, which is the best of the best going head to head. And today you're gonna see the exact opposite of that. It's time to jump in some dirt. Got it, okay. Yeah, no one else jumped. Ancient, ancient Olympics. Olympics. Dirt. Dirt. Oh, you, you guys actually jumped jump that together. time. Time to jump in some dirt. Woo! Eugene! Oh, God damn it. We got it. What are the events we'll be recreating today? You'll do um, three events of the pentathlon, the long jump, the discus, and wrestling. But the foot race is the most important. If you want your name on the Olympiad, you have to win the foot race. Long jump is extremely weird, very different from today. You use weights. Probably you ran about 10 meters. You launched off on one foot, went up in the air, and went into a ball, and landed 
like a gymnast, so that your footprints show in the dirt. And we're naked. And you're naked. Oh, God. Good Lord. What's the team I'm representing? Corinth. Fucking Corinth, let's do this! Up and Tay. Yeah. Not bad. bad. Let's go for two. I didn't do a great job. I'm going to jump further. Oh. Oh. Well done. What's my team again? Corin. For Corin. Happy day. Oh. Oh. It was an inch further. An inch further. Yeah, corn. Use the momentum from the weights to guide you forward. Three to five pounds has been shown in modern experiments to actually increase the distance you can jump. Oh, fall! You fell. So if you fall over, if there's a big butt mark on the ground, it doesn't count. Disqualification, but on the ground. So I'll take a minute and look at uh, Eugene's ass. All Woo! right, that's funny. All right, one for the ladies. Up you take. Wow, he f yeah. Ready? Alright. Happy tech. Doesn't count. That was a good slide. It counts from where his back foot is. Boo. Nobody Boo. likes Delphi. Nobody likes Delphi. Why does it smell? There's a lot of it's, it's like poop. It's, this is this is it's fertilizer. This is fertilizer? Yeah. You're jumping in sand like today, right? You're jumping in dirt. Happy tech. Come on, Corn Diddy! Hobble to the finish! Wow! Oh, pretty good. You got me, bud. That's right? good. Nice, bro. Happy tag. No. <laughs> Didn't get that one. Happy no. tag. God. Uh, no. Not quite. No. Hey. 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 Don't be hey. 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 Come on. Some of the names of officials include words that indicate that they can hit you. And then incidentally, people comment about the kinds of things you might get flogged for. Pardon me, flogged? Yes. And cheating is big. So if you cheat, you can get flogged. If you false start, you can get flogged. Right there in front of everybody. My name is Ned Fulmer, Nemia State University. Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be tech. Yeah, bro. Whoa! No, oh, no. He just ran straight through. Come on! Round two. Up and take. Don't fuck up. Oh. Oh, there's a dog. Oh, hello. Oh! Oh, don't pee. It smells like shit, so he's gonna want to pee here. Determination starts in the mind and ends in the leg. How is Ned the married <laughs> one? I don't know. Up and take. Okay. Yo. Yeah. Oh! oh. Check the butt. There's dirt on the butt, man. Yeah, there is. The what? But right where you would poop. Ah! <laughs> no! Come on! And the winner for the long jump is the Olympian from Delphi. Fuck it, man! So I don't even get a medal, it's just... No, you just get a palm. You may have a palm of victory as you win your individual event. Well, at Olympia, you literally win an, an olive wreath and some ribbons tied around you, but no money. No, no, money, nothing we big. Love no metal ribbon. Next is we will be throwing the discus. You start and pull back your arm and get a big swing and go up high and let loose and never actually twist around very much. And modern discus throwers, when interviewed, are pretty horrified at the possibility of missing out on all that good rotation. That's just like tossing a frisbee? Not even. The olive oil makes this especially hard to hold. Happy day. Ah! Wow! Good toss! Return the discus! Oh, this is heavy! It is sort of like our discus. In art, often it's bigger. Show it over, Chief Eugene. Happy text! Ah! How do you oh. think he did? Let's oh, discuss. Do we get more olive oil for his hands? No! Happy <laughs> text! Ah! Nice! You got a little bit further like you wanted! I know that if I throw it at a 45 degree angle, it will travel the furthest. Because I went to the Science Olympiad. Nerd. You cheater! Cheat! Cheat! Ah, cheat! No, cheat! Ow, it was ow. disqualified, so we did not mark it. You gotta not step over that line, bro. I'll be tank. Oh no, <laughs> Ned, 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 oh no! You cheat, you get beat! Olympia! Nice. It was a nice toss. Terrible.
Are you not entertained? Can I try it like a frisbee? No. no. I'll be safe. No. Yes. Better than Ned. First try. Boom. Now that I'm like doing well, I kind of want to try it. Okay. Oh God. Can you give me like, a little pat for good luck? I think you're starting to like it. Third attempt. Apatow. Apatow. No. <laughs> Can you use two hands? Can you use two hands? The Greeks do care a lot about form, so you probably want to look beautiful while you're doing it. I'm the last to go, which means I'm the furthest to throw. Everybody knows Corinth's got your butt. Right. Happy day. Oh! That hurt my arm to do. I'll tell you what, that was not easy on my wrist. Wow. wow. Same distance. Go deep. Looks like Ned got 36 feet. Nice. Myself, about 41 feet. You got one and a half foot more than him, so 37 and a half. And Eugene freaking obliterated us. It's cool. And the winner of the discus is Eugene. And the losers. Come on! But we're going to wrestle for glory anyway. It's time to, to wrestle! wrestle. Oh, sorry, I can't be too. careful. Wrestling you have some rules. You're not supposed to eye gouge, you're not supposed to bite, and you are supposed to use finesse um, and elegance in your throwing. So it's more like wrestling today than the other events. I'm gonna be wrestling Eugene. And me and Zach are gonna hug and roll around in some shit. You start standing, and very often you put your foreheads together in a sort of ram position. And then your job is to upend your opponent and get his back, shoulder, or hip in the dust where you can see the, the mark on his oily body. Appetite! Go, go, go! Yeah! yeah. Let's go, Zach! Come on! Come on! Come on! Bring him down, Zach! Keep Get him, Zach! Zach, you just break Zach! He's so slippery! Keep, keep, keep. Zach, Zach! Zach, get his knees! It's so oh, sexual! Like, grab it! It's impossible! Oh! It's hard to grab a man when he's covered in oil. This is for glory. Don't hurt each other. Appetite. Yeah. 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 Go. Oh. 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 Yeah. What's up? What's up, baby? The me. Oh. Oh. A little oh, bit headed. too much. That was oh, different than ours went. Appetite. Yeah. 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 How do we know all this? Well, if you're an archaeologist, it's infuriating because we don't know a lot. There's a thousand years of information, most of it's missing, so we have to find weird things that give us information. It's incredibly fun to come up with the scenarios for how it might have worked and wait for somebody to uncover some more evidence. <laughs> Defense. He has a very large butt, it weighs him down. Round three, each holds a point, so this round will determine the winner. If we both lose at the same time, we can tie. That's true. Yeah. Fight for Greece. Appetite. Yeah. Come on, Candace. Yeah. Get in there. Oh. 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 Zach went first. He won. We were just trying to tie. That's not right. When you're covered in shit, you don't know how to play. Corin! Appetite. I just rubbed shit on my face. Good match. Good match. Cool. You guys are idiots. And the winner of the wrestling event of the pentathlon is the Olympian from Namia. This is for my wife and all the people in the great state of Namia. But uh, Eugene did win the pentathlon. Doesn't matter because it all comes down to the race. That has poop on his face, so I kind of think he's still the loser. Being the fastest is what counts, but they're not timing them. You have your left foot forward, your right foot back, you lean forward, but you don't go down so low as we do today to, to push off. We know that sometimes there were ropes that were let down so that you couldn't start too soon. Are the Olympians ready? Barely. Yeah. Yeah, ready. If you win the foot race at Olympia, the entire 
calendars based on you. So What? Do you get to do a photo shoot in the calendar? They don't have that, but they know your name. Zach and I won't do so hot today. That's my biggest competition. That's right, Eugene. I'm coming for you, baby. Hercules! Hercules! It's that this Hercules is not killing his wife. Three, two, one. Happy tank. We're reconstructing the Olympic oath taken on the first day. You have in your hands the flesh of a boar that oh has God. been sacrificed oh my God. on an altar to Zeus. Oh. I swear on the flesh of this wild boar, sacrificed to Zeus, defender of oaths. And I will do everything to dishonor the Olympic Games. Zach, did you say everything? everything. I, I will do nothing. You can't put words in the middle of an oath. Zach, you're holding a sacred boar. Believe that for a goddamn second. That I bad? think that we're in big trouble. God! Ah! Ah! I beat Eugene. Glory. Eternal glory. Well, at least for four years. We're just We're as good as Eugene! Good good. Congrats to Matt on his victory. Congrats to Zach and I on for technically tying with Eugene. This is proof that if you work hard, you can be an Olympian too! Oh my god. <sighs> If we were celebrating a succession of Olympics that had never ended, this would be the 698th Olympiad near the end of the four years. So Eugene, son of Jay, please climb onto the podium. Oh my god, oh, this is my huge. God. The goddess of victory, Nike, is with you. Eugene of Delphi, holding the palm, you are the victor in the many skills of the pentathlon, having overcome in long jump, discus, and wrestling. Well. <laughs> in honor of Zeus, we crown you with a wreath of olives. I kind of wish the Olympics featured these sports today. I mean, who wouldn't want to watch a bunch of naked people rolling around in dirt? Ned of Nemia, son of James, climb on the podium, please. In this 110th Olympiad, holding the palm for the victory of the Stadion. Because of your swiftness, your name will be associated with this Olympiad for all time. <laughs> You mentioned a calendar? Uh, well, you serve as the name of the calendar. You would be on it. In honor of Zeus, you are now awarded the olive wreath. The fact that we are naked just gave us this sense of purity. Like, it was just your body and your mind and your determination. I noticed they have ribbons. Do Keith and I get a ribbon? No, because you're losers. I can't get my back. Do you mind? <laughs> sure. Uh, you oh know, I God. have a lot of respect. I didn't like the Olympics coming in. Now I think they're pretty cool. I still don't like the Olympics because I smell and feel terrible. <laughs> I've learned so much about manure and oil and all four of you, really. So sorry. This is what most Try Guys shoots are like. <laughs> in honor of Greece, obviously. This is the Greece that was on us. We have saved all of our goop and have brought it here for you to judge. Sometimes they save the material, the oil, the sweat, the dirt, and put it in a container. And the gymnasium they practice in can even sell it. I'm thinking that one's pretty clean. And the goof belongs to... Yeah! Wow! Wow! You love me! You really wow. love me! Thank you so much for <laughs> educating us on the accuracy of our attempt at recreating the Grecian Olympics. And until next time... What, what will we try next? I lost everything.